A child may be born with scoliosis or can develop scoliosis, also known as curvature of the spine, later in life. There are treatment options for pediatric scoliosis. Dr. Sean Duxbury of Southeast Orthopedics and Sports Medicine has more about this common condition. Most of the scoliosis in children is identified between the age of 10 and the age of 18, their adolescent years. And that's because that's when kids are going through their big adolescent growth spurt. And as they grow quickly, the curve grows quickly. So a lot of times it's a very small curve that nobody noticed before and it starts to get bigger and bigger and bigger and suddenly people are like, oh, there's something wrong with my child's back. So some signs you can be looking for in your kids is shoulder asymmetries. It can cause one shoulder to go up in the air. A waist asymmetry, if you're looking at your child and they shift off to the side or there's a crease on one side of their waist and not on the other. A rib hump, once rib humps get bigger, you can actually see the rib hump with them standing up. Otherwise, if you get them to bend down and touch their toes, you can see that rib hump coming up on one side. So the most important thing I'd like parents to know about scoliosis and its treatment is that it is very treatable. Through bracing and surgery, we have excellent options that have really good outcomes and long-term function. And also, you can get it treated right here in Cape Girardeau now.